Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ms. Roxanon, to, and this is Daily Rambles. Today, we are we going over Arrow, Season 3, Episode 7, Draw Back Your Bow. I just wanted to say, I've had written so much stuff. Like, here's all my notes for this episode. I've probably, literally, written so much more than I've had in the past, like, three weeks, four weeks as I started doing shows and stuff in the past, in the past like four years. I've probably written so much. I mean, I've almost filled up, I've filled up this entire binder of notes and stuff. And I think it's what, 70 pages? Yeah, 70 pages. And I've already started on another notebook and I already completed my other notepad full of stuff as well. So I've written like a ton of stuff in the past like two months total. I probably have in the last like four or five years school was of course different but anyway back to the main topic here so uh, we start off this scene where we have a flashback from six months ago where Eros is Cupid during the siege of the city and she got all infatuated all in love and stuff so Cupid dresses Isaac up as an arrow and as like a sick calling card and stuff and then we have a flashback scene where Oliver and Katsu argue and um, it turns out Oliver doesn't know how to do laundry whatsoever. <laughs> and then we go back to the present day where Felicity walks in on Roy doing the salmon ladder. No, Ray. I'm just kidding. Not Roy. Ray. Um, and Felicity goes, oh my god, I have a type. What the hell? <laughs> Which is like one of the funniest moments ever. Then Ray asks Felicity out to dinner. And uh, at first she said, oh, no, 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 I can't do that. But she sees the dress, she said, and she loves that dress. And then there's a press conference where um, Ray renames the company um, Palmer Technologies. And then um, Arrow finds a note in the actual Arrow that was, um, was shot with to kill Isaac. And finds a note in it, tells them where to go and finds a shrine to him and uh that shrine is like it's not one little corner where you're just like admiring somebody this is a full-blown house and a full-blown room just full of stuff and it, it, she's just straight up nuts and then um then we cut to where Roy gets depressed because um Cupid just jumped her and knocked him out just so quick and then uh, Felicity takes the night off and goes to dinner with Roy. And then, um, then when um, we go to the flashback scene where Katsu and Oliver, Oliver go to find Shiro, who is missing and they're trying to find him. And then we we'll go back to the present day where Thea is um, auditioning DJs and it's not pretty. These are some bad DJs. Like really bad DJs, and then um, but she did find a good one, but he was really cocky, and, and she's like, "You can go now." And then we find out that um, they found out the chick's name, um, keep the same, which I could don't remember her name, and she's appeared at a lot of Era's crime scenes, like a lot of them. She's appeared in like a bunch of them, and. Then we find out who the guy is uh, that their next target is. And then Cupid gets Arsenal and just knocks him out again. And then Diggle visits Felicity um, in the office. And then we cut to Arrow, talks to um, uh, the girl's name is Carrie, and talks to her therapist. And, um,. I mean, he does get information, but the therapist is like, uh, you need some professional help. <laughs> and he's like, I don't need, I hate therapy. <laughs> then, uh, then we go to flashback scene where Oliver gets kidnapped. And then we cut to, um, present day where Cupid kills a person that found out who, found out where the liar is, the layer is. Oh, yeah, so, um. Yeah, so then Oliver gets jealous of Felicity and, and uh, Ray. Then we have a flashback scene where Katsu kicks serious ass. She is such a good swordswoman and just a, a general ass kicker. So cool. 
They think um, Katsu's husband is dead, and then we go to the present day where it's dinner with Ray and Felicity. And um, the dinner is actually going very well because they're meeting with this other company that he wants to buy the uh, mines for. And then, um, so then we go back to the club where Thea is, and that DJ is sucky as crap. Like, no one is dancing, no one is there, then, uh, well, people are there, they're just kind of just standing around. And then, uh, Cupid walks in, but Oliver manages to lure Cupid away, then it's Cupid versus Arrow, and, um, she actually handcuffs him to a railroad because they fall through, um, this wooden, uh, ground thing and they land they landed to like the underground railroad which shouldn't even be running at all but apparently it is so anyway she chains him to the railroad but he escapes and saves her again and then um he basically just captures her and puts her in the suicide squad amanda waller takes her and then it turns out cassie's husband is home and the flashback scene then we go to the present where um dj kisses thea and then we cut to the guy sells the mind to Palmer because uh, Felicity gives like a really good speech about how um, Ray is as a person, as a business person as well. And then Ray and Felicity kiss. Oliver sees it and leaves. Then Roy, um, then Ray leaves because um, it was a very awkward um, kiss for him. I don't know why yet. And then Oliver gets mad and then Roy and Oliver go to Diggle's for dinner because the Diggle's been offering for the past like several weeks like hey why don't you come around for dinner me and Lyle always make a little too much food so just feel free to come over so they finally do that and then um then we see Ray is working on a suit then you have Captain Boomerang's intro yay so um I gotta yeah so anyway super fun episode I really like this episode a lot uh, I guess A plus because I like all the dynamics that are happening, but I will always ship Alicity. Always. Always. So, but I do like the direction they're going in, though, because I don't mind it long as Alicity's the end game. That's fine. So, anyway, um, that's pretty much what I'm going to do it for me. So, if you like this episode and this A plus episode to me, um, if you liked it, please let me know. If you agree or disagree, there's a lot of stuff happening outside. Sorry. So, uh, just comment down below what you think of the episode. Did you like it? Dislike it? And then subscribe for more stuff that's coming up very soon. And I, I tend to talk fast. So I'm trying to slow that down. Anyway, so I'll see you all next video. Bye, everybody.